Okay, people, I am back out here again because I figured this would be a big media event, and it is. Channel 5 is out here. I didn't really bring my GoPro uh, handle. I didn't bring my 4K camera, which I really wanted to bring, which I should have, but I didn't even bring the case for the camera. We are out here right now. Channel, um, channel 4 is around the corner with Darsha. I think it's Darsha Phillips. And Channel 5 over here is uh, with Mary Dade Macbeth. I think that's her name. So I'm going to go across the street right now, and we're going to get this on video. We are going to get this on video. I know, I got this little wimpy, wimpy camera, but uh, nothing like nothing like the media has. But when there's a story that happens in my neighborhood, I like to cover it. So we're going to cover this story, because not everybody watches the news. In fact, some guy just walked up to me and said, Why are all these media cars over here? What's going on here? I live on the street. Hold on. So I told him what was going on, and he was really shocked. And we're going to go across the street right now, get some of this on video. Um, check out my channel. I just posted something earlier with uh, 4K, with uh, probably better video, better audio, better everything. So we're going to go get this. We're going to get this on there right now. Let's go get these people on here. This is where she was killed. What a way to start a video, huh? Okay, now we're going to watch this car over here. and Watch the speed that this car has as it's going around the corner. So what we had here is we had a woman at about 1 o'clock this morning. And 1 o'clock this morning. Hold on, we're getting there. We're getting there. We're going to get all of this on. Now that I've got the full story. We had a woman at one o'clock this morning who was allegedly in this coin op laundry with a friend, 49 year old woman in this uh, laundry place. And this is all allegedly, I have no guaranteed facts, uh, but this is what I was able to pick up. She was in the coin-op laundry with uh, somebody, and she wanted to show them her new skateboard. And so from what I'm able to pick up from the whole thing is she went out of the laundry place, and I believe she rode her skateboard across the street to the gas station. No guarantee. This is all alleged. But she rode her gas, her uh, skateboard over to the gas station and then rode it back. Now this street has very dim lighting. It has city lighting, but the lighting's not the greatest. And she supposedly rode the skateboard back across the street over to, and I'm gonna look for the marks on the ground now. They were here this morning. I don't think they have removed them, but maybe they did. Maybe they did. There were two chalk marks that were on here. If they have been removed, then make sure you check out my video that I posted a couple hours ago, and you'll see the chalk marks. Okay, I think. I could be wrong. I could be wrong. But I believe this is where it happened where we have this circle over here. See, we've got these two chalk circles. I believe this is where it happened. This is where the tent was set up, right over here. We're at Campdell Street and Pershing. And that's why these two vehicles are over here for the news. So we've got uh, somebody who's coming by and walking really slow because he wants to hear what I'm talking about. So I'm gonna do a non-audio pause until he gets away from me. And then I will continue. Yeah, he's slowing down a lot. In fact, now he's stopped. So, that's what happened. She uh, supposedly rode her skateboard across the street, ended up coming over here, and got to this one location, a vehicle, this is the number two lane. There's really, yeah, there's two lanes. One of them, it merges into uh, one lane. She supposedly uh, edged over here, a uh, vehicle hit her, and 
the word is that she ended up on the sidewalk. Let me get away from this person. It's kind of incredible that there's a speed sign right over here as we're doing this. So she ended up on the sidewalk, supposedly DOA immediately. The person, there's video of this, the person who was in the laundry place with her, or the person, who, yeah, who had been with her, jumped into his car and took off, possibly to chase after the person who had done this. So I think at that point he knew he needed to find the person. I don't know if he got a license plate. I don't know what happened. All I know is that uh, the guy was arrested within a few hours, if not sooner. Okay, now that person's gone now that I walked away. The guy was arrested. Uh, word is possible DUI and narcotics. Not sure. If they tested him for that, I don't know why they came up with that, but supposedly that is the arrest, uh, DUI and narcotics. And the thing is, he probably ran because it was DUI and narcotics. If he was just driving and he hit her, the street is pitch black out here. It is so dark. It's really dark. And she's on a skateboard at nighttime. There's no reason that they would have charged him at all. They would have just said, accident, it happened, and we're done. We are done. Look at this. Oh, boy. But he took off, probably because he was uh, DUI, and took a simple accident and turned it into a felony hit and run Everyone's so cool out here. Felony hit and run, DUI, and uh, they might even throw on a manslaughter charge. So this guy has uh, got a lot of problems ahead of his life now. So you'll get a 30 second, maybe a 45 second cut on the news, but it's not gonna be as awesome as mine <coughs> because I am the awesomenessist. The awesome, it, the awesomest, the awesomenessist. Oh, is that a word? You can see how dangerous it is being out here. It, it is. This is L.A. It's kind of freaky and scary out here. So. Please do a thumbs up, a subscribe, a like, share, comment. If you like my videos. If you like my videos, please donate to my PayPal channel to help me out. Make sure you check the video description. There are some, see, you gotta be careful here. People crossing, people. Check the video description. There's some affiliate links from Amazon in there. Maybe click on them, that will help me out a lot. I think we're gonna get the walk sign in a minute. People are being very cautious today. People are really cautious when they see a camera. Okay, so somebody's talking right now, and um, I think we're done. They kind of missed the crosswalk because they were talking to that guy about what was going on. And so there you see it. She probably took off from here, went across the street, and zam, bam. I don't know what somebody's doing out at one in the morning doing laundry and I don't know why a 49 year old is on a skateboard and I don't know why they're riding on the street in the middle of the night in the dark and I don't know why a guy is driving drugged up and with alcohol and hitting somebody and taking off but this accident totally could have been avoided and should have been avoided All right, people, I think that's more than enough video. That's it right over there. Very unfortunate, very sad. 
that this happened. If you have any comments, feel free to leave them. Nice comments only. Thanks for watching.